I've been told since living in South Africa, and I've lived here now for 10, 11 years, that one of the ways that um, Kosa people celebrate the um, departed is by killing a beast. And when they do so, in order to celebrate particular qualities in the person who has died, the animal is killed in such a way that it makes a lot of noise. The more noise it makes, the easier it is apparently for the ancestors to, to hear and to respond to the, the honour of the person who's died. Um, this seems a little hard to me, but I respect it. When I die though, I, I hope that things are done a little differently. And this short poem is called Codicil, as if I'm adding a little bit to the bottom of my will. Codicil. When I depart to meet the ancestors, don't make anything bellow for me. Such screams of wretchedness never pleased, though I've both suffered and inflicted grief. Tether no beast in the kraal for me, prepare no sacrifice, slit no throat, but look that animal in the eye, see yourself there, see me. Like yours, its suffering is also mine. Free us from the torments of those who bleed, show mercy, respect each feeling thing. Haven't our ancestors endured long enough? So as I pass on, I cast you this instruction, don't make anything bellow for me. Long deaths and agonies never delighted, but loved it, loved it. Remember this.